Hello everyone, welcome back to some more of our Pathfinder series. Before we head back out, I remembered that there was a task we can do, right? The... What was it? I'll find out here in a moment. Oh, here we go. This one too, not the one I was thinking of. Oh, requires 100 BP. Oh... Requires 50. Also, it's Harem, so he's on his... You know what? Let's just skip days until Harem is done. Build points and income. Build points are the Baron's main resource. They are required for settlement upgrades, construction, project management, and so on. The Baron's treasury weekly income is 30 BP sent by Jamadi Aldori from Bravoy. Apart from that, your territories have their own individual income, which consists of their basic income plus other BP sources. Basic income depends on your barony stats. Each rank adds one BP point to the weekly income, but the total a rank contributes to basic income cannot exceed the profitability of your income. Each, okay. Each rank adds one BP, but the total a rank contributes to basic income cannot exceed the profitability. Uh, the barony's economy rank equals three, and it adds three BP to the weekly income. The population rank equals five, but it cannot add more than 3 BP to the weekly income due to the baronies. Oh. So, like, this plus 2 loyalty can actually only contribute a plus 1 because the economy is at a plus 1? I think so, because that would be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. That would be only a 1 because of the economy, and we're getting plus 5 due to the economy bonus, which I'm assuming is all the ranks put together. I'm assuming. Okay. All of the VP sources, such as trade agreements, are added to the basic income as is. Half of the barony's income, except the initial 30 VP, is sent to Bravoy. You will be able to claim independence from Bravoy to retain the full VP income, but lose the initial 30 VP income later during the game. You'll be able to claim independence to retain the full BP income, but lose the initial 30 BP income later in the game. So we're getting 30 from Bravoy. Is the tax... The stuff we're sending back to Bravoy? Wait, what? Half the Baronies income, except the initial 30 BP, is sent to Bravoy. Okay. An important visitor has arrived at the castle and demands an audience at once. Well, sure, let's do what you want to do. I was going to go around and look for stuff to do, but no, I'll talk to you, I guess. What could possibly be that important? <sighs> Stefano Mosconi. The man before you reeks of vanity. His black hair is curled, styled, and generously waxed. From the hair atop his head to the points of his mustache. His cheeks and forehead are powdered white, giving him a pallid look. His hand rests casually on the golden hilt of his rapier. As he approaches, a mean sly smile appears on his face, clearly practiced and prepared in advance. Ah, the ruler of this barony. I'm flattered by your attention. Sir Stefano Mosconi of Patax at your service. The man performs a derisive bow. What brings your Pataxian noble to my barony? I was just traveling back home to Glorious Patax after paying a visit to Restov, all in service to King Castruccio Iroveti. I thought I might take a day to visit the capital of Patax's bold new neighbor. Sir Stefano sniffs and grins. I must say, I really should have spared myself the trouble. It's hardly worth seeing. Ha ha ha! Oh. I 
I'd watch my tone were I you. At least I send you back to Patax in a box. Or perhaps several boxes. And now we resort to insults. Hardly surprising. Sir Stefano lets out a long sigh, tapping his rapier. Well, you aren't worth the glove it would take to challenge you. Besides, you'd probably just run off and hawk it. It's easy worth twice what you've got in this throne room. Dude. Give me the option. Sir Stefano stares at you and snorts. You know, the initial goal of my visit was to take measure of your so-called barony to see if you had anything of value to offer to Patax. And do you know what I found? Nothing. You have absolutely nothing to offer. <laughs> Military weak, culture weak, economy weak. You best pray to all the gods that my King Yorovetti doesn't declare war on you. On the other hand, maybe you should pray he conquers you. This mess of a barony could rule, could use the rule of a proper king. Another word, and I'll send you to the gallows. Oh, I'll be on my way, don't you worry. If I were to stay any longer, I fear I might pick up fleas or lice or whatever else passes for subjects in this place. Take care, no need to send me off. That man must die. Okay. Well, that was fun. My barony is like two weeks old. Uh, a little over a month old now, actually. Alright, well, our relations are plus one for that. Sure. How much longer is this? Ends in four days. Okay. What other projects do we have? Right, we don't have the funds for this stuff. Hmm. You will plunder. Trade agreement. Ah, uh, no advisors. Project costs 1,500 BP? Holy hell. I'm wondering if I should take the offer from this guy. Oh, right, I can't because I don't have the right advisor. I need to meet some more people. Apparently, there's more people out here. All right, skip day. Restore the Temple of Elk to its former glory. No. Why is that popping up? I already sent someone to pillage it. Hello. What is this? The locals are bored and don't know what to do with themselves. This is the perfect moment to hold a celebratory event, but what exactly? <laughs> are those the only two that can do anything? Vine plus three. A giant weed is taking over. Oh. The priest managed to convince the peasants that the weed must be stopped. The crops have been saved. Divine plus three. Heartbroken mother begs for help. Okay, so now that you're back, go back out. And another visitor waits in the castle. How much BP do I have? 68? Gosh darn it! Harem is the only like. All right, tell you what, let's build something here first. I guess we'll build the longhouse because that's the basics. Hmm, it doesn't really matter where. Put it there. Well, it kind of, it may be, no, no, it doesn't matter. With this kind of configuration, any one of these four centers are the same, basically. In terms of like how many buildings can touch it. All right. Well, we can cite the granary, but. Hold on. That's not the most important thing. Well, you know what's great. We're evil. Have some evil buildings. Gosh darn it. Build a damn stock. Oh, right. Also, I wanted to do the monument and the shrine to Urgothoa. Right? That was her name? Urgothoa? I'll get it one of these days. 
A heartbroken mother begs for help. Yes, peasants, what do you wish of me? Peasant woman, her face soaked with tears, approaches you quickly. Oh, your grace, woe is me. I've met my darkest hour. You're my last hope. By all the gods ever prayed to, don't leave me in need. My name is Jenna, Jenna Tannerson. Our village is a short way from here. It's been two days since my boy, Tig, ran away. And I haven't seen him since. We've searched and searched, but it's no use. If you don't find him, no one else will. Mm, do people disappear frequently here? They sure do. There are so many hazards around, it's hard to name them all. Wild beasts in the forest and monsters and some troblins? Troblins. Bandits and whatever. Even adults have a hard time surviving here. And for a little kid, oh. <sighs> I know what you're thinking. I'm evil, so why would I do this? And I'm coming to the same conclusion. Hmm... Hmm. How does this benefit me? Because that's typically what we're going to decide on how to do things. How could a peasant benefit me by finding her child? An argument could be made that this whatever it is could affect more peasants, and without the peasants, we won't have a barony. So if there's something snatching our peasants, I would need to know about it. Hmm. Do you have any idea where he might be? Jenna looks around cautiously and whispers. There's this old hag in the Gnarl Marches. A swamp witch. I won't say her name out loud. Don't even ask. The mere thought of her chills the blood in my, in my veins. She has the evil eye and she eats people. She even turns into a black raven and soars in the sky. I will try. Loyalty plus one. See? Even if you lie to the peasants, <laughs> you still get loyalty. What kind of parent will let their child roam? Where was that at? Oh, right over. Okay. The Gnarl Marches. Well, that gives us something to do as well. Oh, Brigongar is busy. Aren't you? Yeah, you're busy pillaging a temple. Alright, we'll take off your gear again. You can keep your shirt. Okay. All oh, right. Wait. The dex doesn't do anything for you. Gosh darn it. I would prefer to have the strength, but in this type of party order, we'll use her. Or no, that's fine. Yeah, we'll use her. Okay. I won't be halted. All right. I think I've gotten a couple more coins. Hold on. Did I put any in here? That I can give to the storyteller? He won't go he won't do anything with those. No, we just got the one. It looks like. Yeah. Still upset about the bombardier vest, man. Twelve grand to create a character, dude. That's ridiculous. Thank you. It's just too much. Why would you do that? Leave.
Like a level five spending twelve thousand is just. I don't know. I mean, like maybe when this barony gets up and running, we'll just get a ton of money. Maybe I don't know. But like, I I just I really wanted that bombardier. I really did. I also looked at some of the. Uh, prestige classes classes. I don't know if they're called prestige classes in Pathfinder, but the classes that we Can eventually become and I think we're definitely going to be making Valerie into a stalwart defender She already has all the prerequisites except for the base attack bonus of plus seven So I guess by level eight we can have her become a stalwart defender. I Don't know if I really want to do any of the other ones though. Maybe There's a Eldridge Knight, which I think would be a good class for Rigongar to go into because it's an arcane spellcaster that also has I think like martial uh, weapon proficiency I think so yeah this is fine I haven't used Vest for a while but I really like Octavia and without Jaythal up in the front that's only really just these two yeah my guy isn't really a frontline fighter. Though he can substitute himself for monsters, though. Bridge over the Gudrin River. Hmm, okay. Oh yeah, we can go claim this. So where's the uh, Gnarl Marches? Southern Gnarl Mar Oh, God. Oh, wait, no, that's where we meet the Dryad. Yeah, the... She must be in here somewhere. Well... Let's go claim that. And they said that I should be back home. Oh, Jesus. Back home by the first of the month? Shoot. You cannot Bandits. stand against me. Oh, it's goblins. Oh, isn't that cute? Look at these little goblins. Unworthy. Yep. Leave it to Amiri. Amiri, you badass. I'm listening. With your fancy hat. Uh, nothing there. Here. I am your shield. State your desire. Nothing there. All right. Well, I won't be halted. Let's get out of here. Oh, you know what? I spent all my BP, didn't I? We're not going to have enough for this. I wish I could see my stats from... Wait, I can do the Kingdom stuff at any time? Yeah, we only have 3 BP. I can't even claim that stuff right now. I guess I can. Whoops, I thought I had to be in the city. Oh. Huh, okay. Well, I'm glad I clicked on that. So yeah, there's no point in going over there. So... Let's start... Let's try and finish the lines over here. Alright, 
It's nothing there. We've been all the way up to the abandoned hut. It does go up further north. Let's go deeper into this part. I need to catch my breath. Dang it. I'm hungry. When we stop. Might as well. <clears throat> Hold on. There is an event. What event? A nasty rumor is spreading injurious to the Baron's reputation. It is said that Bravoy wants more territory and that Lady Jamondi Aldori's people have already been dispatched to get rid of the local population and free up lands for the colonizers? But Tristan is... I mean, but I... I see, um, 10 days to solve it. Alright. I guess that means I lose Tristan. Kind of a big deal. He's kind of my cleric. Out on this journey right now. Wait, what? So... Am I crazy? Didn't it say that if you put them on a task that they're gone for that task? I'm hungry. When we stop. Okay. I guess maybe I was wrong. So now we're building this. So I'm assuming when this is finished, we can go in here. Because I don't think that building is technically built yet. Alright, let's dispatch again. Let's explore this. We should go up. Maybe there'll be another four that we can cross. Evade. It'd be nice if there was a four like right there. my breath all right well this works I'm hungry when we stop you just go back here and continue traveling I mean I could camp out out there I suppose I probably should we'll do it next time it does need take to quite a while to get back here. See, I totally could have used Ragongar. Gosh darn. So that just goes back to the Temple of the Elk. But it does also go around that way. Let's go south of the Thorn Fjord. Or Ford, not Fjord. Travel down the river first. Hello, the old Mesa. I spent my childhood near the old Mesa. Not this new Mesa. These young whippersnappers love so much. I won't be halted. Okay. 
I don't know exactly how strong a greater were tiger well. is. You I'm assuming it's I'm rather listening. strong. You have my attention. Shield of faith on That's yourself. Mm, hurricane Give bow. The order. No one stands in my way. I doubt I can hold person on a wear. Oh. I'll give it a shot when we actually get closer. Share your troubles. And a wear tiger, probably evil. Probably. Well. I mean, it could be somewhere around neutral. Let's do that. I'm losing my temper. And then we'll try and have a, a puppy block some damage here. I am superior. Wait, why not? This spell's not supposed to work like that. All right. Well, so much for. Oh, Jesus. This thing has a 17 armor class. You dealt 8 damage, but it was reduced to 0. Oh, Jesus. Okay, so that's damage reduction. Can you... Here, let me try and hold person on this person. It worked! Tear them apart! Power attack! We got the hold person spell. Um, I don't think I actually cast full strength on you, or did I? No, I did not. Okay, so you do your thing. Um, try and hit it with that because it can't counter attack right now. Okay. Any more Wow, hold person, you're so good. You're so good. I flick my heart wounds. Kick its ass. Kick its ass. In this case, I will do a bone breaker instead of summoning a, a creature. Because I think the summoned monsters are not going to be able to get past this damage reduction anyway. <laughs> it's still under the effect of this. It died standing up. That kind of reminds me of that scene in, uh, well, I don't want to, it's a scene in Logan, but I don't want to say it, because if you haven't seen Logan, it's a good movie, and I don't want to spoil the scene, but it reminds me of a scene from that. Um, Breastplate, magical. Dude, whole person, I'm telling you. When it works, it works. Actually, I think it's, I think it's worked both times. I've only tried to cast it twice, and I think it's worked both times. Maybe I've cast it three times, I don't know. Breastplate plus one, medium armor with a seven armor class. All oh, right, you can't wear medium. But you can. <laughs> You're outside of your your little window. That would be two additional armor class. We do lose the use of bark skin, but but I could just give this to a Mary. But is it really worth it though? She'd only have a 17 AC. Yeah, that's fine. Well, no, she wouldn't have a 17. It'd be a 19. Oh, no, it would be a 17. I guess she still has bark skin on right now. Okay, never mind. Still, 17 is better than nothing. One resistance bonus on all saving throws and cold resistance plus 10. Resistance on saving throws... Oh, you know what? Here. I'll put it on Jathal. Okay, cool. Uh, but we still do have this light armor that gives bark skin. It'd be one less armor class for me, but technically it would be a plus one if I invoke its power. 
I do like the look of this more, though. <laughs> and looks mean everything. Hmm. Hmm. This, this is fine. I either give this to myself or I give this to Ragongar. Let me give Ragongar this change shirt to plus two then. That works out for me. Alright, well, Were Tiger, that was something. Too bad old person countered you pretty hardcore. We do it my way. This is why I stopped hanging out at the old Mesa. The locals got a little rowdy. Onwards! They were like, you want to join my were tribe? And I'm like, no. Were gang. I should have said were gang. I would no, this is a more clever I way. There has to be some kind of wordplay for were gang. Like a were tiger, but a were gang. But better than were gang. I'm just not finding it right now. Is that it? Is that all that's here? A couple of dead bodies and a were tiger? We do it my way. The old mace has really gone downhill from here. There used to be a gas station at least. A 7-Eleven, I believe it was called. It had the worst hot dogs. Alright, well that's the Mesa. So that's completed. I guess we can maybe search in, since we're already down here, we can search down in this. Oh god, we can go anywhere. I need yeah, I was about to say, like, maybe we should just stop in Johnston at this point, because we're going to be close to being fatigued. Um. Look at that wall! Hell yeah! That looks pretty cool. Um. Can we rest in the tavern? Maybe old eight legs will sell a person for less than 12 grand? Maybe I'm crazy. I need to catch my Cannot rest here. Dang it. Lena. Hello. Show us what treats you have. Oh, wait, what rumors do you have? Lately, everyone's been talking about the tower at the Candlemere. They say lights were dancing around it like a busy cook stove. Everyone who saw it says different things. Some witness a dragon, and some glowing hamsters crawling from the lake. Oh, hamsters, huh? They're probably all lying, but the place is definitely spooky. All right, what trees do you have? Oh, you have air. Oh, this is where the camping supplies are too. And things that we can use to cook on the road. Hmm, well, I'll tell you about that. I need to put this in storage. I can't bring myself to sell it. Do I really need all these? I have the one. I mean, yeah, potions can always be good. I guess. Uh, here, sell some cider. Oh yeah, sell this eel. So here, offer. Yeah, there we go. That works. And here, you can always use a short bow, can't you? Deal. So, uh, Anarol Eight Eyes, you gotta reduce the price. God! That still hurts just looking at it. Why? I'm Why, Alcat? Why did you make it that way? I know you probably love your 
people that you created, but come on. Let us create our own team for something less than whatever the hell that is. I'm gonna collect all this and then sell it to We do it my way. Oh, that feels wrong. But hey, you know I'm the king. Baron, sorry, I'm the Baron. I'm not a king yet. Hey, Elena! Show us what treats you have. I'm going to offer you this stuff. Yes. Sell. subjects? Is that even a thing in this game? Would be pretty cool. I rested. So, is... I, I gotta check if the task that I sent Tristan on is actually being worked on right now. While we were out adventuring. Because I swear it said if you assign them, then they are, you know, being used for something. Um... Yeah, ends in six days. I think it was ten, right? Weird. 35 PP? Uh, we could claim that other resource. But I'm not going to go that way. Well, I mean, I guess I should. I should probably claim the resources as soon as possible, right? And now we can use Ragongar. Because... Yeah. So we'll substitute out Jathal. I like Jathal. Especially since she is into the same goddess that I am. But I like Ragongar more. You're gonna get the chain shirt plus two, the fancy helmets, and I'm going to give you the dexterity. Well, no, no, I'm not. Why would I do that? Just give you the strength one. Yeah. Okay. So you are set. Beautiful. There's gotta be a way to just, like, not have to run through my city every time I want to leave. Keep those in storage for now. Probably really don't need a, that thing. Also, I can sell these drinks. I'll keep those drinks and sell them on our way out. <laughs> I 
it's just like these loading screens, man. They just kind of take too long for me to want to walk through our city every time I want to leave. I would like to see your goods, vendor. You may have my alcohol. Mm, I'll keep the milk. Get rid of the shield faith. Remove curse will definitely keep. Some of that sweet herb. Deal. Do you have anything else? Do I need anything else from you? Cold iron earthbreaker. That just sounds cool. A tongue. Nope, I don't want anything. I'm hearing grunting. Hmm. So we go north, claim this, and then we head back south. Jesus. I think we should just like finish this road. I claim you in the name of me. Uh, no, I just want to go here. There we go. I need to catch my breath. Really, I should rest in Johnston so we don't. Uh, but I'm not going to, cause I, I hate the loading screen. Shoot. Otherwise, I'd I'd pop in there and just rest, but it's. It takes so long. I shall end this I suffering. The hell, a cobalt alchemist? A flame shaman? I'll cut you. Oh, you're dead. Okay. I don't think. Hmm. I don't. I don't think these I two cobalts would halted. actually ambush us. I don't believe cobalts are super brave like that. Two versus six. I don't think is something that they like. But that's fine. Okay, 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 okay. Hmm. Make some haggis? Why not? Wait, who are we missing? Oh, we're Gongar. Intimidating posture. Only one ration was found? What the hell's that? An old outpost? Uh, hold on. Where am I going? <laughs> I 
Where is Varnhold? Pay 15 BP to claim this resource. Economy plus two? Yeah! An ancient riverbed with rock salt deposits. Hell yeah! I need to catch my breath. I want to go to this old outpost. Military plus two. Time and weather have left their marks on this walls of this old outpost, but it still seems to be in pretty good condition. Yeah, we'll man that outpost and can watch over the river there. <laughs> Hell yes. My strength betrays me. Wait, we all oh, right? Cause the bridge isn't there. Ah, oh, son of a. Can I build a bridge there? Dang it! This random encounter—they're pointless. They're like a minor inconvenience. I shall end this suffering. More kobolds. Right. Tear them apart! Consider me provoked. Ow. Alright. I suppose we could rest here. I am going to put you on here because we really want to get more than just one ration. Valerie, I have a hole in my shirt again. Could you mend it for me? You know your way around the field. If I pick up a needle for you, it'll be for sewing your dirty mouth shut. Ding. The haggis was spoiled! It's game over. That's it. I won't be halted. GG. Like, even right now, I'm thinking I need to go back to Johnson so I can pick up some more rations, but it ju I just... I just don't want to load screens. That would be the smart thing to do, though, because we're going to be passing right by it. Well, we'll explore a little more down here then if we're going to be going. Ah, coal mine. I don't believe I have enough BP to claim that. Nope, I'll check. The projects tab will allow you to upgrade various aspects of your barony. New projects will come your way during the game as you meet certain conditions or undertake various ventures. To start working on a project, assign one of your advisors to it. Spend BP? Yep. The luxurious ritual pr procession fascinated the rituals, or the rich, the locals. Jesus. Uh, congregations have flocked to the temples, and our citizens devote themselves to mindful contemplation. Plus five to the divine, which in our place would be Ergothoa. We have more cultists. <laughs> Plunder the Temple of Vulcan Robin. Oh, yeah, success! Plus 150 BP! Way to go, Gongar. Keston wants to discuss the situation in the Nara Marches. Okay, so I'm going to, have to go back and. I'm going to... Okay, so I need to go back to Johnson anyway. Well, we have 150. That's 1500. Right, and I can't do that. I can't do the agreement.
But the thing is, you want to spread the stag god's faith, and I don't want that. Here, the nature of the Davic Nettle Curse. 45 days to solve? Jesus. Okay. Uh, we can maybe do some more building. I need some BP left to claim the mines. And they call it a mine. 105 BP. Okay, so longhouse still being built. We want to make... Well, the alchemist shop. When adjacent to a tavern or a longhouse. So we do want to do that. I want the monument and the shrine. Although, honestly, like... Our divine is already super high because of Harim. Though this does give us more loyalty when adjacent to a longhouse. And plus one additional divine when adjacent to a monument. I will build the monument first, and we'll build the shrine here, or there. Either or is fine. And I'm going to save the rest of the BP. And exit. So I'm hoping to claim that new mine, and then we head back to Johnston. All right, how the hell did we... Must be down through there. Another thing popped up? So this heads all the way to the bridge. And there's no stops between? I mean, there must not be. So this mine, you must have to go through these mountains to get there. All right, let's just go to Johnston now. Or maybe go this way. I need to click on this, right? Because it could be an event that is only around for a day. I've already pillaged it, though. Why are you? Si why are you? Sh it keeps showing me this. I've already pillaged it. Are you saying I can pillage it and then rebuild it? I am kind of curious what the special region upgrade is, though. Why does it have to say a special region upgrade? I don't care about their religion of the era still, but I need to know what this is. Gosh darn it. I may need to rebuild it if it still let me. I don't want to miss out on, the, on a unique thing. Maybe we'll just pretend it's a shrine to Urgothoa. I need to catch my breath. Oh. Okay, so there is another path here. Maybe that'll go back up around. I need a higher sneak skill. I think Octavia's sneak skill is pretty high. Not high enough, though. I shall end this suffering. My breath. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Tear them apart! This is a little more serious. Regonga. I'll cut you. Mirror image. Okay. Summon monster. Mm. 
Large person on a Miri. Alright, let's start hitting him with the uh, negative energy. Hopefully our wolf will at least keep them distracted. This hurricane bow seems to be kind of pointless. But I'll cast it again. Do it again. Positive healing. You're just shocking grasping everybody, that's good for me. Regonga. Uh, Regonga, you go up there. Let us strike okay, that way. Repent. Go get him, pup. Go get him, Morgongar. I need to catch my breath. Okay. Okay, okay. We'll head back to Johnston. Nothing worth. Oh man. Like I just wish I could click Johnson and it could be like, yo, do you want to rest? Yes. Do you want to leave? Yes. I, I need that on the menu. Cause there's just, it's just, it's. Ugh, it takes too long. My strength betrays me. I know. I'm hungry. When we stop. We're stopping now. All right, I had to come back here anyway, right? Because someone, something required my attention. We have a moment of respite. Your Grace, Keston's face looks worried and fearful. Your Grace, ill news from the Nara marches again. There were already many trolls there, but now people are afraid to leave their houses. The wilds are said to be swarming with them. The hunters were the first ones to notice, then came to the merchants delivering packages and food to the outskirts of the barony. Now there are more and more reports of trolls attacking villages. At first, I took the reports for gossip, thought it was just the fear talking. But a local group of merchants recently reported that most of the trolls seem to be lurking around the house of one Bartholomew Delgado, an odd mage living out in the wilds all by himself. They saying, they're saying there are so many trolls out there, nobody can reach Bartholomew for fear of the beasts. Those trolls are up to something, and this strange Bartholomew fellow is clearly tangled up in it somehow. If the wizard's gotten some idea in his head to conspire with the trolls, we should make the first move and hit them with our preemptive strike. However, if the trolls are coming for him rather than to him, it will be an enormous help if you could pay a visit to Bartholomew and figure out what's going on. I recommend haste. If nothing is done soon, there may be a grisly fate in store for your subjects. Oh, shit. If it's not one thing, it's another. My help is one troll. What's a dozen or more? We are super powerful. I won't be halted. Was there anything else I need to check in on here? You know, while I'm here. Ah, the nasty. Yeah, the nasty rumors. Okay, cool. Plus three loyalty. Neutral sightings. Yep. Plus one military. So we have no other events. The projects here. I have insufficient funds. Insufficient funds. We're researching into nettle, right? Like, didn't I have Horim doing that? 
Yeah, it's right there. Okay. Word that I don't see is card up here. But that's fine. Alright, and so then they're in the Nara Marches somewhere? Shoot. Okay, well, we're gonna have to deal with this. I want to explore to the east, and especially grab that outpost and the mine, but this sounds like it's kind of a big deal. I don't think my peasants would appreciate being eaten by trolls. Something tells me. Well, you know what, I think I'm going to end this episode here. I'm going to leave the city, probably going to mess around with the inventory a little bit, and then I will see you all in the next one. We'll head to the Nara Marches. So thank you for watching, everyone. I will see you all then. Take care.